Okay, so let me introduce myself. My name is Rezvan Panati. I'm the head of Power Electronics Technology, and I'm here today to talk to you about cutting edge power electronics. At Marelli Electric Powertrain, we focus on two main products of great importance for all electric vehicles the inverter and the BMS, or the battery management system. Okay, let me try to be very clear. If you compare an electric vehicle with a human body, where the car chassis is like the human skeleton and skin, the motor like the muscular system that allows the body to move and the battery with its current flowing in and out, acting like the heart and the blood system, offering energy to other systems, an inverter is probably best associated with a neural system which creates impulses at the right time, in the right sequence, to activate the muscles and eventually produce motion. An inverter takes direct current from the battery and converts it intelligently in alternative current, energy, for the motor. It activates in agreement with the operator requirements in terms of torque and speed. Now, the BMS is more complicated. It's like a constant present EKG system that checks the heart checks the state of charge, the power, instructs all the other systems about how much it takes until the body needs to be recharged, to rest, or how fast it's going to sprint. Well, it all starts with a vision. We have to define where we want to be, how aggressive and how realistic our goals can become a reality. That roadmap that we build feeds then our incubator, our advanced engineering team who scouts the market and after a careful evaluation funnels selected ideas, technologies and other exciting new products into what we call a component kit phase. We use that phase to build a new generation of products based on a set of new technologies aiming to reach a certain set of KPIs. We can only work in the current market and with the existing customers. So we rely every time on uh, and collaborate, of course, constantly with our sales product management colleagues who make the necessary corrections along the way. Once a new component kit is tested and released, we are ready to customize it and build the customer applications. The whole development time is dramatically reduced. The customer sees the benefit of our up-to-date technology readiness level which translates into less risks associated with achieving milestones or delivering with a high quality. <laughs> I thought we need to keep this interview short. Talking about technologies we are using today is a very tough question to achieve this goal. Anyways, there are too many of them. If I could pick a few, I would probably start with the fact that we are committing to use only wideband gap semiconductors, both silicon carbide and gallium nitride. And we focus mostly on 800 volts or higher operating voltages. We think this is the future level used by all EVs in the market. Uh, another one, we just launched wireless communication in the battery management systems, one of the very few systems like this in the market. That's because we believe we don't need more wires and time-consuming processes in the assembly phase. Next, we'll be launching uh, some extremely small DC link capacitors. We will eliminate heat. We will try to avoid heat production by creating modulation and control algorithms suitable for this purpose. Well, depending on when this interview will be aired, we can be anywhere between 160 and 200 experts in power electronics, electromagnetic compatibility, functional safety, mechanical design, testing and prototyping. We grow very fast in all regions with competencies in all major topics and continue to ask for support from our partners. On a scale of 1 to 10, we only aim for 10, even if suppliers many times struggle to support our ideas.
Well, I worked in the renewable and alternative energy sectors for many years, and I dedicated my career to companies that have one mission, to promote resilient and sustainable ways to produce, use, or conserve energy. That means my passion is only focused on the very specific EV sector of the automotive world, which I believe to be transformative for our society. Well, I love my job, but if I want to pick something, maybe announcing that we have passed design or process validation tests flawlessly. Handing over then the products to customers. These are probably the best. And of course, after that, celebrating with the team all these amazing moments of satisfaction for a job well done.